Broads, Lisa and Christine, and we're here giving you a an idea of what you can do at a park if you need to work out, get that 20 minute workout in or something. So we're going to start out today with like trying to do some chin up. Now, 
Lisa was saying that they were too easy on the slide. <laughs> nope. But it's a start. Hanging there with your body weight. Makes you taller? <laughs> that too. This is called the stretcher. Dangling here for as long as you can. Here, let me at least help you with this. Come on, let's do one chest. Come on. Uh, one, two, three. I'm gonna help you. Okay, one, two, three. <laughs> Go on. Oh my gosh, these shoulders are just not doing it. See if she can do it. like good workout for me in a long time I mean I do some cardio uh, you know walking with the kids things like that but to actually do some resistance training feels really good um, haven't done it in probably since like January so um, it's always usually been part of my my life since I was a teenager in nature there are no excuses with not being able to work out think about it you can walk outdoors. If you've got kids, you can come to a park and work out while they play on the swings or whatever they decide to play on. You can run, you can do push-ups, you can do weights if you want to take some sand in your hands and do like bicep curls or two water bottles. That works. See, like things like that. There's always a way to work out. If you need any ideas, because you feel like you're not so creative, message us. We'll think something up for you. It's important to be a role model since I'm uh, modeling how to work out at the park and I'm usually at the park several times a week. I'll, uh, I'll definitely uh, try it out more of them. So get out there and just do it. Dance, move, jeez, dance. <laughs>